Welcome to the video solution of the exercise screening 2. In this exercise we are going to consider the following heterostructure. An aluminium gallium arsenide structure is sandwiched between a gallium arsenide layer and a metallic gate electrode. The aluminium gallium arsenide regions contains a single ionized positively charged donor in the center. It is at a distance d half from the metal and the gallium arsenide layer. In the exercise we are going to calculate how the potential energy of an electron at the aluminium gallium arsenide gallium arsenide interface is influenced by screening effects. Therefore we consider the two cases with and without the metallic gate. To calculate the potential energy for the system with the gate we use the concept of mirror charges where the constant potential of the metal gate is uh, the mirror. Hence, in addition to the positively charged donor, there is a negative charge at a position d half from the metal. The mirror charge of the electron at the interface does not need to be considered as it will just give a constant offset to the total potential because um, if we move basically this electron along this interface the mirror charge which would be somewhere here um, would move as well so this would just give a constant offset to the, um, to the potential. So um, first of all um, we can now um, write down the potential energy um, in the um, xy plane um, for the case where we uh, do have a metallic gate. So the potential energy um, at the position of um, the electron here um, is given by the sum of the um, basically the, the Coulomb potentials uh, created by the positive charge and the negative charge so this is this term and that term multiplied by minus e so uh, we get an e squared here. So this is the solution for the case with metallic gate um, and now for the case without a metallic gate we only need to consider the potential energy due to the field of the positive donor charge. And this is just the uh, first term um, of um, this equation here. So um, for the case of no metallic gate uh, we get the following um, expression. So um, um, this is the result um, for no metallic gate um, where um, well what well, one has to note that basically also for this equation here we only considered um, like one dielectric constant so we assumed that there's the same dielectric constant of gallium arsenide and aluminium gallium arsenide. Um, so if we now plot um, both potential energies so this is what I did here um, you can see that um, well on the x-axis we have basically um, the x-direction so the position of this electron with respect to this um, to this uh, donor charge um, and on the y-axis we have the potential energy in arbitrary units and um, these two graphs um, show the results for either having no top gate so for this case here without the metallic gate or the solid line is for the case of having a uh, metallic gate. 
And what one can clearly see is that um, both the extent and also the uh, minimum value of the potential energy is um, lower for the case of having, um, having a metallic gate. So this means that uh, basically um, we can see a screening effect um, due to the uh, metallic top gate um, in the system.